Yes. Oh, yeah. Down here, this is the open paddock. That's all about. Yeah. We're going for a walk. Yeah. Okay. Oh, your boot's coming off. Is that what it is? Oh, I see. Okay. Come on. Dad, look at all these weeds. We had to plant down. Oh. What? Look at all these weeds. Oh, the weeds. Yeah, there's a lot of weeds that popped up up here, isn't yeah. there? Good spotting, Evie. 
I can see us. I can see us. Let's fly down there. Yes, with the oh, oh, yeah. I see a giant Yeah, nice. No, see it too. There's the giant fire. <gasps> Mm-hmm. Um, that was that It's a tractor. Yeah, yeah. Tractor, that's right. Yep. Look, it's going to come out over there. It's a green one. Look, down there. There's a green one. Whoa. I wonder where it's going. To our house or not? No, I don't think it's going to our house. Hey. Yeah. If you went to our house, you'd be stuck with the driver. Mm-hmm. Please, please, please. Oh, oh, oh. This is going to be a big one, Mom. Dad, it would be a big one. Yeah, slow and steady. Hello, boys. Hello, boys. Yeah, I'm waiting for chance. He's slow coach. Come on, mate. Good boy, buddy. Good boy. <laughs> Time, isn't he? But he is a bit slow, isn't he? 
is. He's a bit slower than the other dogs. Good boy, Chance. He's just holding us up with this bottle lid game. Yeah, a bottle lid game. He wants to do it himself. That's it, mate. Almost there. <laughs> Chance is happy with this pace. Across the river? Yeah. Fast one. Fast Breakfast. Hi, Spirit. Hello, Miss Red. How Hello, does sleep? Standing up. What? Yeah. How Could you imagine sleep standing uh, up? Uh, uh, that will be uncomfortable. Uncomfortable. That's right. I think so too, but not for horses. Yeah. You getting out of there? Do the same thing as humans. No, that's right, they don't, they do different things. Yeah. Like we definitely made it dirty. Let me see. Mud everywhere. It's good fun though, wasn't it? Yeah. Hello, spirit. Okay, let's go. Yeah. That's 
right. It's a pool heater. A truck. A truck going down the road. A truck, yeah. Hey guys, it has been one of those mornings. Oh yeah, go Spirit, go. So I just got distracted by my galloping horse. She always looks very impressive when she runs. But it has been one of those mornings. Woke up this morning and there was about six different lots of diarrhea in the house. There were diarrhea in each of the rooms. And so therefore, it tells me the food that we cooked didn't get down to temperature after we put it in the fridge. We probably cooked a little bit too much yesterday, therefore there was too much to cool down. Didn't handle the load, didn't get down to below five degrees in with under two hours. Therefore it went bad. So we had to throw out all that food and cook up another one today. On top of that, we ran out of gas. So the girls had a cold shower this morning. I'm just loading up some gas cylinders now. A um, couple of other things didn't go to plan, but we're back on track now. It's about 10 o'clock in the morning. I'm already sweating bullets, but I hope you guys are enjoying your day. We're back on track. We're online. It's okay. It's just a little speed bump in the day. You ready for your breakfast, Alan? Yeah. Yeah, you're cute, aren't you? You're a cutie horse, even though you are a bit cheeky. Hey? Even though you are a bit cheeky, how does that feel good? Yeah, get that dry mud off your face. You've been rolling around. <laughs> You've been rolling around and don't eat the camera. Hey? Yeah, hello. 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 Yeah, I Did you get it, boy? Did you get it?
Sweet pea.
can't see it from the other side. And when I went round, I was exactly the same. That's crazy. It's all this rain, it's just shot up. Look at all that clover, I've never seen clover that big. Look how pink that is. Goodness. It's like the healthiest clover. Is this really a weed though? Clover? Mm. <laughs> Sheep love it. Do they? You look at that, that's like one of the ugliest weeds getting around. And it's huge. Gonna have to get the weed burner down here. Maybe you only ever see them when they're low on the grass and then the mower goes over them so they never get a chance to get mm. that big. What's under there, Lily? What's under there, darling? Oh, Lily, 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 Hello, Jelly. Hello. Hi, Shadow. Hi, Shadow. Was you being cheeky this morning? Is ya? Don't mind the floral arrangement. <laughs> How are you, mate? Doing well, bud, aren't you? Yeah, good boy. Good boy. Give old Till a kiss. Box of love. Yeah, good boy, Bandit. They've been friends for a long time. What's in it? What's in there, Lil? What's in there, Lil? Every time Till goes like. Hi, Tilly. Hello, beautiful girl. He's definitely a lot more relaxed, isn't he? Training this morning with Hank Chopper and Nevaeh. Nevaeh just needed a refresher because she's letting herself get a little bit uh, excited and she's still doing what I'm asking, but it's a bit sloppy, it needs to be sharper. Uh, she was fine, she just went through the motions and picked the box. But Hank and Chopper, I found a, um, 
little personality characteristic in them today. So, on lead, just like the most perfect boys. Just like, look how good I'm doing. And then off lead, look this way, look that way. I'm like, chopper. <laughs> nah. <laughs> it's nice to do a runner. Oh, okay. We'll go back on lead. Back on lead. Perfect boy. Do everything. Not a problem. Off lead. Chopper. Nah. <laughs> like three times in a row. I was like, righto. We're going to do some more work with you, mate. Well, you haven't really done anything with these guys. Nah, I did a little bit when they first got here. But, um decided that it was their turn and Tank watched the whole thing unfold. So just sat on that, just so do everyone at home understands, all the dogs get trained here. They have to have some kind of training to coexist. They, they have to have some kind of responsive yeah. uh, so, nature to me. So they so do we can guide them verbally. They they do get training every day, but um, in terms of formal obedience going back to the foundation like you know yeah. the long course so, yeah so these guys don't have all those long foundation exercises under their belt yeah they just are getting socialization and management training they're they're not getting the full you know detailed course as such they're getting parts of it but they're not getting the full course they're, that's not what they're here for um roscoe nevaya chance um they're all got the full course so they mm. they perform much higher. And just as an example, obviously you do a lot of training um, in regards to um, yes and no, like so that's you know language. them understanding language and being responsive. Um, in terms of like the really in depth um, like formal training, like that's where we're talking, you know, all the all the um, incremental levels of integrated distraction, yeah. testing, um, all of that stuff. That That's at this stage, like the only dogs that have gone through that is, well, there's a lot. <laughs> it's Roscoe, Nevea, Chance, Fredo, um, so Tank and Chopper. Shadow. Oh, and Shadow, sorry. Um, Tank and Chopper. Well, obviously in all our dogs. Yeah, all our dogs are given. Yeah. All of our dogs are going through it. I'm just trying to explain it to people because um, all the dogs get trained every day, but yeah. they're at different... Um... Okay, it's easier to point out the dogs that haven't gone through that and have only gone through a portion of that to have the skills to accomplish this kind of environment. So Hope, uh, Tank, Chopper, and obviously any of our... Any of our uh, holiday dogs. Yeah. So, so they're in the same. They're, well, Tank and Chopper's got more training than, say, like Minnie and Spaghetti, and um, you know Billy Bandit actually. Minnie, Minnie's gone through the course. Oh. Oh, Minnie. Minnie's done the course. Minnie's done the course. Bandit's, Bandit's done, done the, the course. course. Yep. Okay. Uh, Billy hasn't. Billy, actually, that's I just got to wash my knees. That's one dog, Billy the Frenchie, who I have done zero training with oh. ever. <laughs> Billy just. It's happy to do whatever whatever happens and there's no issue. Uh, same with spaghetti, we haven't done anything with spaghetti either. Uh, but, you know, that's because when they turn up, I call their name, they understand who they are, they know that we're going into a certain area, they come along. As soon as the dog doesn't do that kind of stuff and follow those simple instructions, that's when I step in and do some training with them. Um, so, the difference, right, you got all the foundation exercises, You've got a whole heap of um, you know, detailed training for the course, but for Tank and Chopper, they're only doing the basics. So sit stepaways and recall. That's it. There's no, there's no boundary. There's no drop exercise. There's no duration training. Uh, distraction there's, there's, training. Yeah, there's no in, um, high level distraction training. It really is just the basics to be able, for them to understand when I call their name and I give them an instruction, I'm talking to them and they need to be responsive to that instruction. If they start ignoring me and they start fighting me or resisting, like what I saw today, then I focus on them more and give them more training. But if they are happy to follow along with what everyone's going on and anytime I talk to them, they respond, then there's no need to do anything. So that's why Billy has never done anything. <laughs> she's just happy. Billy, we're going this way. She's like, okay, yep. let's go. Same with my dog. 
as soon as one of my dogs decides, yeah, I'm just gonna be lazy today, I'm not gonna respond to you or anything like that, then they are the focus of the training. Not as in, we're not talking about, um, you know, you're going for a run and a dog like Fredo decides he wants to just stay on the oh, couch. No, that's their choice. Yeah, we, we allow them I'm to... I'm talking about a formal command. So it happened yes. this morning with Banjo. He's a very, very good high-performing dog. And all the dogs were in here. And I left Banjo out with me while I was running around doing some stuff. And then he was sitting in the front lawn in the sun. And I called him and he just looked at me. I was like, oh, okay. So then I called him again, nice and formal, and he just sort of looked around, looked around, and just sat there. I was like, ah, righto. So then he actually he actually did that three times in a row. So he was just putting up resistance this morning, which he hasn't done in a little while. Um, you know, I've been through quite a few battles with him, but he hasn't done that in a while. And so then he becomes the focus of the training um, for, for that day. Any dogs that show me that kind of, I hear you, but I don't feel like doing it right now or then. Um, that's when we revisit the training and, re and give them a refresher call. The shepherds have done a lot of training. The shepherds have done a lot. But that's us dealing with litter syndrome. Yeah. You know, there's, there's a lot more intense training going into the shepherds because we know the challenges that they're facing based on the fact that they are litter mates and uh, the issues associated with litter syndrome um, and, you know, combating that and preventing any of those behaviours creeping in. Yeah. So uh, I added another dog to the chance run this morning. Oh yeah. So it was the three usuals and then I threw Maggie in there as well. Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. Which went well. Oh awesome. Um, Maggie's a good one to change it up. Yeah. There's a couple more I want to start adding in as well but um, the problem is so in case um people haven't hadn't haven't seen the previous video where you um were you just watching yeah, what's happening over there good boy chancy boy good boy mate so good who good was good that day, oh chopper good chopper and chance yeah. how are you feeling yeah good what were we talking about um, We're talking about bringing. Oh, Maggie so into for the run. yeah, so for people who haven't seen the previous video where you explain that um, obviously running in the paddock or through the bush with either the quad bike or the ranger or the motorbike is probably up there as one of the most intense levels of um, activity. The dogs get the most excited and they behave the most, um, you know, erratic and, you know, as far as he's concerned exciting um, and, and irresistible. Um, so that's where his biggest issue is. And so I've made a small group where I can start exposing him to that level of intensity and it be a safe in, and, incre and increasing it slowly. Increasing it slowly, adding more dogs to it. So eventually he will be out with the rest of the dogs. Chance. Good boy. Good boy, mate. Good boy, buddy. Um, and increasing it so that you won't be good boy, mate. Roscoe, no, cut it out. Um, increasing it so he eventually will be a part of the the whole pack, but slowly but surely. The problem with chance on the runs is, you know, the way that the dogs are getting overly excited is irresistible to him. Is one thing. The second thing is. He is a little bit lazy on the runs, and so often lags behind out of view. And so I find myself waiting at the top of the hill, waiting for him to come up. So if there's another dog down there and there is an issue, um, that's where it's a problem. So that's why I'm slowly introducing it because uh, I need to be able to keep, keep an eye on his interactions. So... Gee, chip. those chips have gotten bigger. Oh yeah. They look like full-blown birds now. Yeah. They're probably still flightless though. Yeah, okay. So Chance has always been up for adoption, mm -hmm. just like Molly was, you know, and someone came forward and Molly like got Nevaeh adopted. Is. Just like Nevaeh like is. is. Yep. Oh, yeah. um, hope, hope is too, but um, we're just um, making, we're, we're not oh. pushing that one because um, 
Yeah, she, hope, hope, hope she needs some this is her um, comfort zone for now. Um, you know, given what she's just experienced. Yeah. But she, yeah, she is also up for adoption, and they are accepting um, applications. Yeah. They're just not going to finalise um, until she the feels. Until yeah. Um, but in regards to chance, um, you know, we've started actively seeking or, uh, you know, searching for his um, forever home yep. um, because we feel that he is at that point now where he is very ready um, to go and, to a go and no live yeah. a normal life. Mm -hmm. Now, but in terms of people listening to you continuing his training and testing yeah. and increasing and all of that, I just wanted to kind of, um, you know, either explain or have you talk about um, the reason why we do that and we continue and we have with all of the dogs whether it yeah. be Shadow or Freddo um, we don't just stop and say oh that's enough um, mm. these dogs are living in a very unusual and unique situation yeah, where they have to coexist free range with a lot of dogs and a lot of new dogs that come and go, yeah. you know, because we board, um, you know, have dogs come for holidays. So like spaghetti. Like spaghetti, yeah. So um, we continue past, you know, what is required of him living in a home with another couple of dogs yeah. um, in a normal situation. He, he, he became eligible for that environment a while ago. Yeah. Um, you know, he's well past that level now, as in he's far, you know, superior in his responsiveness, his training level, like he's perform performing very highly. Uh, and as you can see, he can handle large groups of dogs, but I am guiding him along the way. Um, he will definitely be able to handle um, most scenarios. The only thing for chance would be that if you had another big dog come and pick on him, that's where it'll be a problem. Because uh, he's not likely to take a backward step there. Oh. Hey, cut it out. Just like that. Did you see it? Yeah. Not... So, what's he saying there? <laughs> I'm bigger than you. <laughs> so, he, that, that scenario there um, can go either way. So, Nevaeh won him over during that kind of thing when instantly Nevaeh would bounce around and go, Oh yeah, but you can't catch me, you know, and then all of a sudden it's a game. If Chopper did the same thing, if Chopper was like turned straight away turned into a play bower, he would play with him and they'd get on great. But he's being um, uh, a little bit confronting in his body language and posture before he does that. And then that's just a little, you can see him standing tall like that, it's a little nose poke in the back of the neck to say, you know, could have got ya, what are you gonna do about it? Um, and Chopper did the right thing, he just sat there and did nothing. But that's where I step in and say, we don't play like that, we don't behave like that here. Um, because, like I said, if you had another big dog that was trying to pick on him or wouldn't let any of those interactions happen, which is why Roscoe and him originally were nemesis, um, he, he wouldn't back out. Nevaeh, no more, leave, leave. Nope. Good girl, no more, nope, nope. No, quiet. Lily, leave it alone. So this this kind of environment is exactly where um, if they all start revving up and going crazy and um, he can't process at this stage, what the intensity is. He can't, he can't see that they're all focused on a game and they're not getting tense with each other. So that's why he's still got, um, 
you know, that, that tense moment when he's seeing all the aroused state of all the other dogs. Uh, all the rest of the dogs know that it's a game and know that, you know, there's no risk to themselves. So I was just settling that down because he's starting to burn up a little bit. A little bit too much for him. I didn't go through to the other side, I don't think. Michelle in Queensland. Thank you, Michelle. All right, what do we got here? Uh, Blue and salmon smoko. Uh, yes, please. They're Anza cookies. They're yeah, really good. Do you remember the other day? Oh, yeah. Yeah, you said something about someone sending us Anzac cookies. Well, Michelle, we received them and they're amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much, Michelle. That'll be with a coffee this afternoon. For yeah, sure. afternoon tea. What else we got? Oh, we got some coffee mugs. <gasps> Ooh. Stackable mugs on a mission. Excellent. Thank you. Oh, right, he's like, where's the toys? Okay. There you go, mate. Goodbye. Oh, maybe not cutie pie. Oh, cutie pie on a diet. Miss Violet, good girl. Tank, good boy. Lily, good girl. Rosie, good girl, darling. Hope, it's all right, darling. Banjo, good boy. Chopper, good boy. Here you go, Hope. Good girl, darling. Good girl. Well done. Uh, Matilda? Oh, I thought I had my cookie. I just ate this one. Oh, is that the dog one? The yeah, dog one, yeah. Tastes all it's right? It's still pretty good. 
Just a little bit more plain than that one. Obviously, there's no sugar in this yeah. one. Yeah. Um, Barney. <gasps> oh, and tanks in there. Oh, 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 oh. You've already had yours, buddy. Mini. Good girl. Miss Red. Good girl. Who else? Shadow. Good girl, Shadow. Oh. That's just that three. <laughs> Look at him. He's got a mouthful and I'm running to the water. <laughs> uh, has Barney had one? Yeah, I gave Barney one, yep. Let's go, Come on, up here, treats. They're like balls. Yeah. Stuff your treats. I want the balls. Kid, well, you can have a smidgen. Mm. There you go, she took it with authority too. Let's go, you ready? Oh, uh, I thought he caught it. Nevaeh snatched that. Roscoe! Yeah, there you go, he caught that one. Mum for Maggie here? Yeah. She? Oh, she's asleep. Well, thank you very much, Michelle. Both myself and the dogs love them. I loved it too. I oh, had, had a bite. Yeah, it was delicious. Yeah. Thank you, Michelle. Thank you very much. They're really young, like real, t um, got a good texture, those ones. Yeah, yeah, they're young. They got a bit of coconut in them as well. Yeah. Nice and sweet, I like it. Got a little spider on this one, check this out. Yeah, I already said hello to that spider. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not sure what type it is. But we like the spiders here. Just like all the animals. So we're going to let him go. Okay, we've got this one from Blake, Haley, Beth, and Evan. In. Uh, I think that's um, quite local. It's in New South Wales. I won't show you the um, suburb there, but I'm pretty sure that's local. All right. Thank you, Blake, Haley, Beth, and Evan. Beauty pie, look at her. Where's my more treats? <laughs> She's tasted the Anzac cookie, yeah. and she likes it. <laughs> Don't you know you're a little pug and your volume of food should be a lot less than Freddo? Mm. She's got to go on a diet. I haven't posted the vet day video oh, yeah, no? yet, so people wouldn't be aware that... Yeah, she came back with uh, some concerns with some of her liver values. She does this to everybody. Yeah. And... Um, so, whilst we don't really give her anything, she does kind of... Actually, the vet here on the day. Yeah. He was feeding the treat <laughs> So, if you're watching this, Vienna. No, names. no, no, no. But it's, I mean, it's very difficult because she, Cutie Pie actually, really... Actually, no, no, no. Not true. Because the blood was taken before all the treats were given. Mm. Cutie Pie was one of the first ones. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah, I know. But, I mean, as you can see, uh, she is quite persistent in her begging. Oh, she doesn't take no for an answer. Yeah. We don't fall for it. No. Anyway, we get distracted. Oh. oh, wow. Isn't this nice? Oh, that's beautiful. Wow. Yeah. Oh, gee, that's so lovely. That's awesome. Oh. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Yeah. It's lovely. 
I feel like I see her name everywhere now. Yeah. Yeah. I was driving um, literally the day after she passed and um, the car in front of me's number plate was Faith. Really? Like I just feel like I've never seen it before yeah, and I, I see it all the time. Mm. But that's beautiful. Thank Very you so nice. Much. Thank you so much. We'll definitely put that in the, in the house. Yeah. This one's from Helen. Um, what does that say? It's from Helen in the UK. And I'm just looking for a, a suburb here. Oh, I have no idea how to pronounce that. What are you going to try? Helen from the UK. Thank you very much. I'm sorry, I can't pronounce. Oh, is it the suburb? Yeah, I think so. It's like a really long... Let me have a look. Let me see. Off camera? Yeah. Um, okay. Yeah. <laughs> well, which part of it is? Chubba, get down. Bodog and Ang Angles. Yeah, exactly. That's why I didn't attempt it. Oh. What's, your, what's your attempt, Sam? Oh, goodness. Everyone's going to have a chuckle who knows oh, no. exactly what it is. Oh, no. And then they're all going to tell me oh. what it sounds like and how to say it. <laughs> but you're not going to be able to because you're going to write it and it's going to be written the way it's written here. No, but you can write um, phonetically, you know, how it sounds. You know what you can do? You can Google it and they've got a... Um... Google pronouncer. Yeah. Let's quickly type that in. So we get sidetracked. Sorry, guys. I just... Fredo just wants his toy thrown in the pool. Throw it, throw it, throw it. Please don't be offended. It's the first time I've seen it. Um, however, I have looked up the map of where it is. So thank you very much. It's a long way from here. The they, like they couldn't stop um, sniffing that one, oh, the dogs. They? Yeah, right. So I was thinking either treats or a, a certain toy that they know, but. Yeah. Oh, well, there's marshmallows. Ooh. Ooh, the girls love these. Oh, they love marshmallows. Don't they? They sure do. I'll we'll have to toast them. Oh yeah. Got some jerky here. Oh. That's why they uh, yep. couldn't stop smelling it. That makes Amazing. sense. Oh, and there's a litter. There's a little kitty cat. Ah. Uh. Oh, uh, Luke and all your family, I send you love and thoughts. What is such a difficult time, despite everything you're being, you bring me and all the followers such joy and happiness from the farm, and I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, you both are inspiring and true angels of the earth, uh, and I am so happy I found your channel and became a farm member. I admire so much your compassion, knowledge, and true devotion to all your family, children, and dogs alike. Um, Other passion that you show in all you do. Uh, I hope the enclosed will go some small way to show my appreciation uh, and love for you all. They are sent from the heart to a special family. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, that's very nice. That's Helen. Helen, send your love hugs uh, and all the beautiful dogs and that my heart every time. Um, I see them especially in this vibe. 
There's a dog. Oh, there she goes. She just popped up. <laughs> Funny how I do it. Yeah. The <laughs> you know we were talking about you. Uh, thank you again for all you achieve. Your selfless passion is inspiring and has a special place in my life. Um, sending love, thoughts, and prayers to you all. Keep being as wonderful as you both are from home. Oh, that's, that's so nice. Thank yeah, you, Helen. So nice. They're really lovely words. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, cool. Girls got some stickers. Oh, yeah. Oh, some fudge. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh -hoo. They got some nice little purses. Oh, beautiful. Yeah, actually, the girls are going to love this little thing. Oh. And, uh, oh, they look interesting. Welsh cakes. Ooh. Yummo. That's exciting. Much, yeah, we got some uh, good smoko today. <laughs> Alright, thank you very much. Oh yeah, you want those? I'm gonna get Rosie token. <laughs> like, I want, I want one of these. Shadow, you want one too? Is that what that is? Cute bite, stop scratching my leg, you're on a diet. <laughs> oh dear. Oh gee, that look, oh. Oh wow, yeah. gee, you'll have to crumble that up. Oh, okay. Oh, this. Oh, here we go. Up on this table in no time. Fredo, good boy. Rosie, good girl. Banjo, good boy. Barney, good boy. Matilda, good girl. Chop, good boy, mate. Gotta get that one. Lily, good girl. Titil, Miss Red, good girl. Miss Violet, <laughs> you definitely get a big one. You get a special mention, Miss Violet. Violet. This is from Helen. Oh, yeah. You Just for you. Yeah, you get it. <laughs> Shadow. Good girl. Joey. Good girl. There's some crumbs up here now. Uh, uh, Barney's already got some spaghetti. Good girl. I'll be little Billy's down Mimi. there too. Where's Billy? Oh, yeah, there. Yeah. Billy. There you go, darling. There you go. Good job, guys. Gee, they like them, don't they? Yeah. Did Hope Thank you get very much. some? She's right behind you. She's, she's getting used to this present yeah. giving. Good girl, Hope. Oh, good girl. So gentle. She's usually a bit snappy because she's nervous at coming in, but she's being nice and gentle. Yeah, get, it, get in there. Well, get... on that though, which is another thing that we discovered on vet day, which I haven't posted, is her severe underbite. Yeah. So that that's right. th that can explain her snappiness. Her snappy. I used to think that she was always trying to engulf the yeah. whole bit of food. But, and she was always hitting my fingers. Yeah. But she's got about a gap that far between... Yeah, the vet said it's the worst she's ever seen. And yeah. it really is it's quite, quite, solid, quite significant. It? But when she's got a mouth closed, you don't really see it. No. Usually with a big underbite like that, the two canines come out the front. Like, like a bulldog, you know, mm. the, that kind of look. Yeah. But she doesn't have that. Yeah. Anyway, she's doing a lot better. And for everyone at home, uh, the vet day video, it is coming out. It's just that it's um, it's so much footage because it was such a big day um, that I just haven't got through um, putting it together. Is yeah, it all? no, it is. It, it, and what did it end up being? Like four hours worth of footage? Yeah, it, right it was it was a very big day, um, but it was great. It was a great day. We had the, all the dogs had blood tests and they all came out and... Um, and it was such a good day for dogs like, you know, Lily, who doesn't like the vet. Yeah. Um, you know, and even Fredo and Roscoe and Nevea, like, um, Nevea and Roscoe didn't look like they'd <laughs> been to the vet uh, that many times. Um, hey, cut it out. Good boy, Fredo. Good boy, mate. 
Look, she's getting up into that uh, jerky bag. Watch, watch, watch. Yeah, she's like, where is it? It's around ah, here somewhere. What are you doing? And then she totally like just yeah. walks away like I wasn't doing anything. <laughs> oh, yes. Oh, it's so beautiful. Poor cutie pie. No. She's never been left out so much in her life. Oh, dear. Little princess. Well, she came with me yesterday to pick up the kids from school. And I'd, so I'll just drop it in there. But, you know, obviously we uh, she's on up. a diet and like we're, we're strict on that stuff. You know, like once she's... We are! You're about I to tell am. a story about how the car's full but of McDonald's But I am. Chips. I've been really conscious about her not getting anything from anyone. And then, she, you know, she's sitting um, in the baby's seat um in the back off to go get the girls and thinking it was great next minute i turn around and she's just she's discovered head all the, the um like old chips in, in yeah, the kids Wolf, seat dropped or left behind the seat or something and she's eating them all I'm like oh my goodness trying not to have an accident you know yeah. she's eating all this stuff she shouldn't be eating goodness me yeah. all right finally got that one open Okay, two doggy daycare farm trips. Um, oh, what language is this? Hol it's from Holland. Holland. From Holland. Uh, yeah. Apologies, not being able to pronounce that. That's beautiful. Oh, wow. That is beautiful. Houses? Windmills? Yeah. Oh. Do people live in those? Oh. It looks like there's like a bottom level in there. There's a window and... Gee, that'd be... That'd be amazing if yeah. it was. Imagine yeah. if they were like your Maybe. guest houses on the property or something. Yeah. Anyway, I get sidetracked daydreaming. I think Fredo thinks there's something in here that there might be... Of, of interest to him. Uh, dear Evans family and friends, here one package from the Netherlands, in brackets Europe. We are two sisters, Gerda and Nell, wow. uh, who are big fans of yours. Wow. What a great job you do with the dogs. The videos give us a lot of fun. Therefore, in this box, some toys oh. for the dogs. <laughs> that's he's that's why silly. he's so excited. And uh, for you two special real Dutch traditional cookies. Ooh. Amazing. Thank you very much, Gerda and Nell. I think that's Nell. Does that look like Nell? Would be, would it? Yes, I think so. Apologies if it's not. Yeah. Um, lots of love from us uh, from the Netherlands. Gerda and Nell. I can't pronounce that last name. So, it's fine. Just for everyone at home, we, um, we just had a battery malfunction and on one of the phones. Off. We are hoping that this video that Sam just took survived and she can use it. So we just read the letter and it was very generous. Thank you very much from Gerda and Nell. Gerda and Nell from the Netherlands. Very, very generous. Oh, <gasps> of course. No wonder wow. Fredo was keen in So Fredo was like. <laughs> Right there. He wanted to open that box. Give me a buddy. Look at that face. Oh, he's so excited. Chicken. Chicken. <laughs> Good job, Oh, hey. it's alright. You can have it. Hey, hey. Bandit. Getting old and cheeky, isn't he? Thank Hi, you very Chris. much, Chris. <laughs> oh, Let's go that way. Wow, yeah, thank, thank you, you so you. much. Look how healthy that looks. That looks unbelievable. Fredo, Fredo. Oh, he's got it. I was going to give him Oh, a you got the chicken, buddy. Yeah. He likes a frisbee, though, doesn't he? <laughs> Bandit already knows. Got that. <laughs> so he's got toy aggression. He's guarding. Yeah. So, and Tank has 
food aggression. Right. But it's very minor in the in the case of you know food aggression. Yeah. It is it is very minor and he's only down to just a bit of a growl while his head's in the bowl now. Um but that's the first time I've seen was that what you showed me last time? Yeah. Yeah, so that was pretty bad last time. Yeah, but he he, he does it all the time. Yeah, okay, so then I need to work on that. Yeah. Alright, well, let's finish opening this amazing gift. Because that looks like a really cool fridge magnet from Holland. Oh, yes, look at that, it's beautiful. Some cool toys. Oh look, it's a squeaky caterpillar. Uh, awesome. They're gonna love that one actually, aren't they? Yeah. Look at this. How cool are these? Oh wow. They're clogs. They're beautiful. That's amazing. Yes, sir. All right, the caterpillar. They're going on my Kieran. Oh, cool. cool. Yep. Um, are these the cookies you talk of? Because I am very excited about them. Uh, I don't think that's English, except that says caramel. Caramel filled wafers. It is English. But that name must be. Ooh. Now, for everyone at home, Luke has a very sweet tooth. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I gotta eat lunch first before I. Eat lunch. <laughs> oh, do you? <laughs> you're right, you're right, I don't. No, like no, I was being Thanks for sarcastic. Me. <laughs> oh, dear. They've come all the way from. Netherlands, how can I say no? <laughs> the <channel> inside. <laughs> oh, I can see it. Yeah, looks amazing. That'd go great with a cup of tea. I'm a fan. I'm a big fan. Thank you very much. These aren't going to last. <laughs> you might not get one, Sam. Oh, thanks. <laughs> they are really good. Mm. Ba back in the day, like right, like back, back, back in the day when you used to drive the bus yourself, mm. like with daycare. Um, I remember Lucy, the golden retriever's owner, used to make you her delicious homemade shortbread. Yeah. And you used to eat it the whole bag before you got home. And when she found out, she used to make me a little bag just. And, tell, and say to you, now, Luke, this is, this for, is Sam, for Sam. And I've made you one for the road. Yeah. And so she'd make me a second bag so I could uh, eat them on the way back. But gee, they were amazing. They she, were. She some amazing oh, i got to say, like, I got excited. Yeah. And I don't have a sweet tooth mm. like you do, but yeah. they were so delicious. Yeah. These are also very good. Thank you very much. <laughs> they are amazing.
got? Hello, bandit boy. Dear Luke, Sam, L, Evans, oh sorry, L, Evie and Wolfric, just wanted to send you a small token of my appreciation of everything you guys do at the farm. I watch your videos all the time and they never fail in making me smile. As a fellow dog tragic, I spend mm -hmm. my free time painting special dogs oh, and wow. Faith is truly one of the special ones. Oh. I love to capture the true spirit and personality of the dogs in my work and I hope this painting has captured just a little of her light and character. Please send belly rubs and scratches to all the pack. Fine regards, Elsa. I think that's how you say Elsa. Oh, Elsa, Elsa? A-I-L-S-A. -S okay. Thank apologies. you so much. Apologies if it's not right, but thank you very much. <clears throat> From South Australia. All right, that's exciting, painting. Oh, it's very well packaged. There you go. Oh. Couple of brochures. Dog paintings, my forever dog. Aww. Facebook, my forever dog paintings. Yeah, I'll, I'll um, check them out. I'll zoom in on it. Oh, cool. Yeah. Now, I don't want to use the knife on this one. Awesome. I can't wait to see it. Turn it around. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, that's beautiful. Captured her, hasn't it? Yeah. Your beautiful face. That's so cool. Thanks, Elsa. Wow, it's just amazing, isn't it? I'll definitely put that. We got one of Wallace and Charlie. Mm. Put it up there. With So nice. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Just take this off. It might be. Oh. oh no, it's not. You took, you took all the squeaky ones. Oh, there's plenty more squeakies. Oh. They're the ones he wants, I think. You don't know think he wants. But he likes this one. These ones. Yeah, but this one, this one, the dogs won't be able to take out of his But man. he wants that one. Oh. That's the 
money on. Lisa, now there's no, there's no address, so I'm gonna say last name, Lisa Baby. Okay. Just watched your latest video and saw the pack, popped their last Swiss ball, and thought you could use a few more. Aww, Thank you for awesome. everything you do for all these dogs in your care and lives from Lisa Davy. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. And now we we've got, always need we more do, of and now we've got one of those robust sleeves yeah, to put yeah, yeah. So over all these Swiss balls. Awesome. Couple of Swiss balls. Amazing. Thank you very much, Lisa. Yeah, thank you very much. The red one. I do like that. Thank you very much. It's very nice of you. We will blow one up for today's day, won't we, hey? Well, we didn't, didn't we pop the yesterday's one? No, yesterday. Oh, because yeah, no, it's still got the sleeve. Yeah. yeah, yeah but yeah. these these can go in that sleeve. Yeah, so. they'll just get when it pops. Yeah, it'll just go back in, yeah. yeah. That's great. Okay, so this one is from Beverly in Tampa, Florida. Thank you, Beverly. We I see that name a lot. Thank you very much. You're very supportive. We really appreciate it. Yeah. Thank you, Beverly. Um, okay, so let's have a look. Aha! Oh, Bandit! It is your lucky day! <laughs> what is that? Look! And Fredo. Look. Oh, there he goes. He hears the calling <laughs> of the piggies. birthday presents a couple of months back and I don't own a dog so sending to you something for my favorite human and canine puppies a few frisbees and pretty much everything else, everything else squeaks a couple prong jumblers and other balls restocking the squeaky pig inventory hope the master approves oh absolutely he sure does after all the farm is bandits country estate <laughs> You're just the hired help. <laughs> How true is that? Uh, and oh dear, seems I've mistakenly packed one of my high heels. Can oh. you send it back? What? <laughs> no, you didn't. Is this a is this a joke? Please tell me there's a high heel in here. <laughs> no. You joking? I don't know, did you read it right? Please give to Jason Snuffle Mat for Waffles and Jimmy. Thanks, oh, cool. Bev. Oh, hang on. There we go. Absolutely. Awesome. Well, I'm sorry to say, Beverly, but I don't think your high heel is in here. Oh, look, there's some t-shirts in there. Hey, kids. <laughs> what is it? She's funny. <laughs> that is 
was just I was waiting for a real high heel. That's cool. Minnie, <laughs> your shoes. Oh, cutie pie. Is this one for you? Oh, it's a pie. Oh, what is it, pie? Oh, what is it, pie? Oh, Barney, darling. Jeez. Three, go. <laughs> <laughs> Hold up the little t-shirts. Cool. <laughs> Runs in the family. Uh, Cute. Secret life of pets. They love that movie. Uh, so do I. Frozen. Evie loves Elsa. Amazing. <laughs> and oh, little wolf. Oh, wolf. Wolves are awesome. I'm awesome. Therefore, I'm a wolf. <laughs> That's perfect. Very cool. Thank you very much. Thank you, Beverly. That is so cool. The kids are going to love those. Yeah, they will. And we snuff mat, the plush toy for Jace, Jimmy and Waffles. Yep. Um, these shelf dogs, but I fell in love with Wink since he was never given nearly enough socialization. Probably not a candidate to live at the farm. There's a mouse who sings, which I read and review. Top five toys of blind dogs. Oh, cool. Um, if I lived in my favorite country in the world, Australia, near my favorite city in the world, Sydney, which I haven't visited in many years, I would adopt Wink in a heartbeat Aww. if I was worthy enough. I Aww. hope that by time. Oh, by that time you get this. Uh, that special someone has found Winx and she has. Oh, she has, Beverly. Yeah. And given her home, she deserves. And I am trying to get some photos um, from who, well, actually, her, her name is Bev as well. <laughs> her, her new mum. But uh, what we have been told is that she is so loved. She's living her best like, life. Like really, it's the life that um, we would could only dream of for um, for Winx. Yeah, you know she she She's supposedly goes to the life. cafe every day. Yeah. And, and L, L, the regulars at the cafe. Oh, cafe. The whole community yeah. have fallen in love with Winx. You know, cafe. all the neighbours love her. You know, yeah. and the best life. and Bev um, and I think it's Des. They feel like she's been there forever. Yeah. Like that's the feeling they have that she was always meant to live there. Yeah. Like that's just so nice. Oh, isn't it? Yep, so good. Really happy for Wink. It couldn't have worked out any better. No, it just is perfect. Uh, final bit. Also, by the time you receive this, I pray that faith is still with us Aww. and not experiencing pain. If not, then I and everyone the world over have been crying for days along with you. Uh, she's finally experienced the most wonderful time in her or any dog's life with you, even though it was way, way, way too short. Love and prayers from Ben, uh, Tampa. P.S. You know what we could all use right now? More Joey sexy ears. Because <laughs> Bev's a big fan yeah, of Joey. More Joey, please. More Joey! Joey. Hey. Did you hear that? It's for you. <laughs> that means Bev says you can pick anything out of this box you like. What do you want? What do you want in the box? You want something in here, Joey? You want something in here, mate? Which one? Which one? Which one you want? Which one you want? You want this one? You want this one? Which one, Joey? This one. Ready? Oh yeah, you want that one. Oh, you want that one? Oh, okay. Ready? Oh, you want that one? Yeah, give it to me. Give it to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ready, 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 ready. ready. Go. Oh, whoa. Ready, 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 ready. Go. Go girl, 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 go girl,
Thank you very much. <laughs> Ooh, Cap South 2019 from Southeastern Australia. Beautiful, thank there, you very much. A, I don't know. Something in here from saying who it's from? I can't see a letter. It doesn't look like there's, um, there's a letter, but, but thank you very much, whoever this was. Uh, just Wines Australia. Hmm. Puzzling. Nope, well, there's no note in there, but if you did send us a case of wine, thank you very much. We really do appreciate it. Apologies that there was no letter to uh, name. We really Indeed. appreciate it. Yeah, thank, you. thank you. It's lovely. Thank you very much. It we'll, will... we'll enjoy a glass. Oh, pass more. out. Yeah. <laughs> After one glass, because it's so tight. <laughs> Thank you very much. Now, I've seen this style of box before. I'm not going to lie, I'm very excited about this. Philip, you send amazing stuff and you've sent it multiple times. I really do appreciate it. And for everyone but at I, home, Philip is. Um, he is a veteran. Yeah, so I was about to say that's yep. what I like looking forward to because he always sends some little snippet of his life and his life in service. He also was in the Navy and uh, last time he sent a couple of photos of him back in his heyday. Um, sent me some memorabilia and all sorts of stuff. So thank you very much. And you always send um, Amazing toys which the dogs love, these little round squeaky balls that they just go bananas for. Um, well, might, they might not be in this one. They might not, <laughs> they might not. However, <laughs> just letting everyone know that this is not Philip's first package. Just like Beverly, Beverly. Yeah, sent Beverly's the same. We, we have a lot of people that are sending things multiple times. Uh, but I, I do like seeing things about Philip's service and hearing his story. My favourite thing to do on Anzac Day is to go and chat to the old timers and talk about, swap some stories about different experiences in service. Oh, how do I even open this? I can't even see a... Sam. A small gift to celebrate the farm. Oh, cool! What is this? <gasps> cool! Wow! How awesome is that? Really cool. That's amazing. Little yeah. does Philip know, but Luke loves chopping boards. Love like you really love them, don't I you? I do, I do, yeah. So now I'll tell you what I love about this one. This is my new thing at the moment. I always buy a chopping board with this around it. <laughs> so that when you're chopping up meat and you're letting it rest, all the juices and the oils come out of it, and then you just pour it back over the steak when it's on your plate. Right. That's what that's for. Yeah, that's what I use it for anyway. This is, uh, this is really cool. That's beautiful. Nice and heavy too. Not sure that I'm going to actually use it though. It's really nice. I don't want to ruin it. <laughs> we could use it as a cheese board though. Yeah. That'd be lovely. Yeah. Very cool. Jilbing, New South Wales. Look at that. We're on the map. I love it. So beautiful. Thank you. It is jam packed. We got some hot sauce. Oh. Amazing. I love the hot sauce you sent last time. So Luke, Luke's salsa. brother recently Yeah, came, came down, down for a couple of days to we... do some filming. Yep. And we had a Mexican night and we pulled out um, all the the sauces and um, the salsas, salsa. I think. We had some hot sauce. From Philip um, last some, time. Um what were the, the jalapenos, jalapeno, and uh, anyway, green, all, green chilies, all of I the think. stuff that he sent last time, whatever I had left, we brought out, and my brother thought it was amazing, as do, as do I. 
So thank you very much. Uh, we do love it. Hot sauce again. Hot sauce. Yes, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Things in the box. Luke, five jars of hot sauce. Thank you. <laughs> Two veteran flags. Oh, wow. Hardware. Two shedding gloves. Oh, like as in the pat the dog and they shed. Oh, cool. That'd be cool. Oh, we need that uh, for the shepherds. And then kids. Geez, very organised. Look at this. He's categorised everything. Kids. Seven kids' toys. Four jewellery sets. Oh. One dinosaur stickers. Wow. Kitty Rose toys. A Wolfric toy. Bandit. You get another mention. <laughs> uh, Bandit. Big bag of toys. Oh, brackets. For you. Home time. <laughs> uh, Sam, the farm cutting board. Oh, thank you. Thank you, although I might be stealing that one. <laughs> Jason, bag for him and dogs. Has his two veteran flags and hardware also. That's cool. Awesome. Lily, personalised blanket. Brackets, oh, love you, Lily. Oh, oh cool. that's so cool. Yeah. Lily, you got something special, Lily, darling. Lily, got something in here, darling. Yeah. Oh. Uh, Sending this off a couple of days after cancer diagnosis with Faith. Oh. I'm very sad about the situation. Yeah. <clears throat> but I am so glad that she's with you. Mm. Loving all the great videos. Everyone at the beach was great. That was pretty fun. We need to do that again. We, we just had such bad weather lately. Um, the look on the dog's faces was priceless. <laughs> Please send Bandit's bag of toys home with him. Yeah, I okay. Put, I put extra stuff for him. Because of his help. Oh, because of his help with hope and faith. Yeah, yeah. they did love him. Uh, also, he's a good boy. Enjoy, Mr. Bandit. He sure he's a good boy. <laughs> well, we'll send it home with him when he goes home from his holiday. Yeah. Just going to zoom in. Oh, Tank was just lying over here. <laughs> in amongst the destruction. Uh, goodness. There'll be some toys coming a couple of weeks after this box. Plenty of JW squeakers. I think that's those balls I was talking oh, about. Oh, yeah. Uh, for Fredo, <laughs> Frankie, Milo, and all the other pups. Roscoe is hilarious with Kitty Rose. They'll be sleeping <laughs> with each other soon. <laughs> I, I have seen Kitty Rose um, start to come up to Roscoe a lot more. Yeah. Even um, like walks over him now and... Yep. Roscoe just, head stays on the ground, but eyes still follow her around the room. <laughs> Thank you very much, Phil. Let's have a look at this. I'm going to find this blanket. Is that it? Oh, yeah. Is that for Lily? Yeah, maybe. Yep. We'll put it on. Um, well, she's got a favourite bed and favorite she's also bed. got a favourite couch. Oh, it is. Oh, cool. I'm going to have to stand up here. Oh. Yep, yep. Lucky I've read it already. Let me... I'll have to step back. Oh, Lily's blanket paws off. <laughs> that is so cool. Oh. What a good size blanket. That is blanket so cool, too. Lily. Lily, that's all yours. It's yours. She'll love it too. Yeah. She's one of the first to go inside at the end of the day. Yeah. Isn't she? Yeah. She 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 doesn't like being left behind. She wants to be involved in everything, but um, she's definitely the first at the door yeah. um, to get in on a bed. Yeah. And then uh, she when loves she does inside come in, time. She just passes out. She goes all day, doesn't she? Yeah. Uh, we're actually starting to slow her down a little bit yep. because we don't want. Um, we give her nap time in the middle yeah, of the day. We don't and want to overdo it as she's getting she older. Doesn't, she's she's very not, excitable. She's not going on the morning runs. Well, that Lily is very special. It's for you, so Lily. It's for you, Lily, girl. Is that uh, shedding glove? Oh. Joey, you want to check it out, mate? I really want to. Um, the shepherds will yeah, love it. Yeah, Lily, the the three shepherds, and also Tilly. Oh, Joey, Joey. <laughs> Ooh, what is that? 
Oh, is that it? Oh, yeah. Cool. Oh, yeah, it works. Lily, what about you, darling? Oh, yeah, good girl. Good girl. Does that feel good? Does that feel good, Lily? Yeah. Good girl, darling. Good girl. Oh, wow, yeah. Oh, wow. yeah. Every day. Gee, it didn't look like anything was coming off, but then look at all that. Yeah. What about Banjo? He's probably got some too. Banjo, come here, buddy. Does that feel good, mate? Good boy. Good boy. Very cool. Mr. Bandit, home time. <laughs> awesome. This is for you, Bandit. Where is he? Uh, oh, there he is. What a, what a, um, a party bag. Oh, just let you have to not do that. Strict instructions. to get into puzzles. Yeah. Like no, he'll love this. Farm animals and things. But he loves songs. He Six does. Five plus songs. Yeah. yeah. Awesome. awesome. Thank, Thank you, Thank you very Phil. much. There's a couple other things in here. Oh, that's one's Jason, Jimmy and Waffles. Oh, yep. Yeah. Let's put, we'll have to one put that in, in their pile. One we'll be seeing, Elle. we'll be seeing Jason soon. Yeah, he'll be coming back as soon as the weather's good. Yeah. There you go. And then some more hot sauce. Yamo, what's this one? Haven't seen this one before. NM True Certified. New Mexico Salsa. Oh, yeah. Thank you very much. So, guys, I just wanted to say a big thank you to everyone out there who has written to us, sent us letters, sent us packages. Um, you know, emailed us with words of support. Uh, it does mean a lot to us. Left you know, us, um, you know, positive comments as yep, well. Positive comments, all, all of um, your support and, um, you know, reassurance that, you know, what we're doing here is valued, not just to the dogs, but uh, to you guys all around the world as well. Um, it means a lot to us. You know, there are... A very small percentage of negative comments and it's hard to sometimes not get swept up in those. But I just wanted to say thank you. We've had a lot of letters lately and, and we don't open the letters and read out all the letters we um, we receive, but I do read them all. Um, and I want to say thank you to everyone um, and just your generosity and kindness and, um, and support. It, it really does help us. Um, especially in... You know, the tougher times, you know, recently, um, it, it, it does brighten our day. So thank you very much. We really do appreciate it. It's amazing. <laughs>
Good girl, darling. Good girl, good girl. This way, this way. Good job. Good job. He's even jumping in now. That's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Oh, she's so brave. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. 